So now the machines are here, they're obviously in position. What's the next step then, Lee? Well, we've got a team from Germany and a team from the UK and a team from Finland. So the Finnish guys are from Fast Stems. They continue with the installation of the FMS and start to build the internals. Our guys are now bolting the machines down on the fixators and levelling them. We should have power on by the end of the week so they can then start to do the, uh, the start-up and commissioning of the machines. Lee, yet again, exciting times for Starag. We're here at the new Boeing facility in Sheffield. It's been three weeks since we've last been here, but can you tell us a little bit about the progress that you've made on the installation of the machines? Of course, Mark. There's, lot, there's lots happening, as you know. The machines are all powered up now, so the installation's complete mechanically, and we've started the commissioning phase now. And when you look at the machines as they are now, can you run tests on them at the moment? We can. What we've done in the last two weeks is we've worked with, um, with Boeing and also with the AMRC and we've been over in Germany to run one of each of the two critical components so that we can prove the fixture in the tooling and that the machines um, are capable of this process and, and everything went right first time, so we're really pleased with that. And when you look at integrating with the fast system, are the guys working quite closely with you to make sure that process is working? Yeah, we, we, we're responsible for installing the machines and levelling the machines and, and doing the geometry on the machines. And then the fast Fastems guys, once the machines are, are ready to accept the pallets, they integrate the two systems together. So they're working in parallel with us at all times. So when we come back in a few weeks' time on the final stage, what would be the progress from here to the next few weeks? Well, the next time we visit, Mark, we should be handing the system over. So everything should be up and running geometry should be done on the machine, the integration to the systems and all Boeing need to do then is to load the parts, the fixtures, the tools and they should be ready to go. And with Starag, you've got complicated machines, very high spec machines, do, do you actually help with the process of the training for the apprenticeships that are going to be here for instance? Well all, all of the training, whether it be training for the service guys or whether it be training for the programmers or the operators is done by ourselves. So. Um, We'll do that either on the machine or in offices. And then the integration itself, we've been working with the AMRC. So there's a smooth transition of the process straight onto the machines. And as we've said before, these machines are very fast, 80 metres a minute. So we're expecting some significant uh, cycle time improvements. So the next few weeks, quite crucial, quite stressful, I would imagine, but obviously quite exciting. Well, certainly crucial, hopefully not stressful and absolutely exciting for sure.